October 4th, 1912. I'm going back to 1912. Teddy was leaving a Milwaukee hotel for a campaign stop. Which campaign? I'll get to it. And he was shot in the chest by a guy named John Schrank. John Schrank was a saloon keeper from New York City. Schrank's bullet lodged in Roosevelt's rib, but it had been slowed precipitously by the 50-page speech and the eyeglass case that was tucked into his coat pocket. We've seen this a thousand times in movies. Oh, my God, it hit the lucky yeah, dime. A, a classic right? trope for... Yeah, yeah, yeah. It, it, it hit my cell phone. But it happened to Teddy Roosevelt. A 50-page notebook, small notebook, and an eyeglass case slowed the bullet down, and it lodged in a rib that was directly in front of his heart, by the way. Okay? That's, that's luck. Okay? And Shrank was originally looking to shoot him in the head. So he had his pistol raised higher. 